Hello everyone and welcome back to another video and this week it is a massive Shein, 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 whatever you want to call it, haul. <laughs> I have done a massive Shein purchase. I've got loads of stuff. I think I've got, I think I've got like 18 things. And I just thought I would make a nice little video to show you everything that I bought um, and try it on. So, this is my first ever time buying from Shein, so I was very excited. I seen Courtney over at Courtney Small World, obviously, um, doing a haul a couple of weeks ago which inspired me to have a look and I couldn't believe the amount of stuff that was on their website. I think all of this came to well over £100 um, and there was like a, if you spend £100 you got 30% off. I think all in all I spent £106 um, so let's get started and see what we've got. Okay, so I've got everything lined up behind me that I'm going to try on. I'm kneeling on the floor, but when I try it on, I'll, I'll stand up. It is a peplum style top and the sleeves have like gaps out of them as well. So let's try this on. This is it on. As I say, it's got these sleeves that are cut out and it's like peplum here and um, i wore this already i wore it on like a date night and i wore it down in london as well and i think the sleeves are really cute i like it so obviously i'm keeping this because i've already worn it next up we have something else that i've already worn i can't resist a black top so it's just black it's got nice little pattern around the neck and then on the sleeves and the bottom it's got this like florally print so let's try this one on. So this is the black top with this neckline and then you can't see it because it's against black leggings but it's got that little florally pattern on the bottom and the sleeves and it's just black and pretty plain but that's the kind of style that I like I suppose there you can see the Literally bits a little bit better. So definitely, definitely keeping this as well since I've already worn it as well. Next up I have this lovely white top. It's polka dotty but it's love hearts. So you can see that there. And then on the front it's got buttons and it's also that peplum style as well. And the sleeves are quite, like it's quite straight and then the sleeves um so it's quite different to other tops that i've got and it's got quite like frilly sleeves i really like this top but I'm not sure let's try it on okay so this top i do feel like it's a bit big um but i feel like i could get away with it and it's because it, it doesn't like cling which is good for like buttons if you know you know the struggle with buttons gaping so this doesn't gape which is great and i like this straight across and then the sleeves i'm wearing a black bra right now because obviously that's what i was just trying everything on with but i'd wear a white bra and um, i like the sleeves yeah i like this i think i'm gonna keep this even though it is kind of a bit baggy but better being too big than too wee so i always say so they're Maybe a theme going on here. <laughs> so again, I have a top and it's got that kind of peplummy effect. You can't really see it on the camera, but it is kind of ruched in a bit here. It's got a tie as well um, on the front. So it's like little flowers, reds and blues and yellows. But yeah, let's try this one on. I think I like this better on the website, but Let's try it on anyway. Okay, so I do like it on. It's got this like ruchny bit and then the tie and quite good length sleeves as well. I just like the colours of this. I feel like this is very summery. Uh, I wish you could see the like tie a little bit more. You can't really see it on the camera or in real life really, but yeah, I like this. Yeah. This this and a pair of jeans would go nice so i think i'll keep this it's a thumbs up for 
Next we have something that's not my usual kind of style and it's this florally print. Uh, it's a nice purple colour. It does have a tie um, which goes round the waist. So I do like this in person but I'm not sure how I'll feel about it when I have it on. Let's see. Okay so I've just quickly tied that there. Probably not how I would have it if it was properly but I quite like this obviously it's a bit see-through you can see my bra through it so I probably have to wear like a different coloured bra it's got the tie it does have loopholes for the tie but it doesn't have a particular place to sit um I like the colour I like the sleeves I'm just not sure how it's meant to sit with this tie like I feel like either ruffles this bit or ruffles this bit um but I think I am going to keep this one and see how it goes in a pair of jeans as well. So one thing you'll learn about me is I'm, I'm very much a jeans girl. I did get a couple of dresses in this haul, but I'm not sure how I feel about them. But let's try a dress on next. Okay, so I have a dress and it is this pink, although this does not look like how it looked on the website. I like the pattern on the website, but looking at it now, it looks a bit granny-ish. It's like lots of flowers and yeah, not sure how I feel about that, but um, and it just kind of is like a straight up and down dress, but I'll try it on and see how it goes. So I'm 100% not a fan of this. You can't even see the bottom. It's like down past my knees. Um, it's not really got any shape to it. It's just a little bit... Just a little bit too old fashioned, I would say. It does have like a tie that can go around it, but it doesn't have any like loopholes for a tie. So I feel like it would be the same as the old one. It would just, as the other one, it would just like bush it a little bit. Um, so I think I'm gonna give this back. But what I'll do, I'll try on all the dresses at once, just so I don't have to put my leggings on and take them off and put them on and take them off. So let's do all the dresses at once. So the next dress I feel is quite similar to this one, again I like the design on the website but not so much in person, although I do like this sleeve and I did have a dress like this a few years ago, it was like a burnt orangey colour and it's got like the border around the bottom as well, um, but I just don't think I like the rest of it, um, but I do like the red, I like red. And I do like the sleeves, but let's try it on and see how it goes anyway. I don't think I'm going to keep it, but try it on and be sure. So this is just, again, similar to the last one. There's not really any shape. I feel like it kind of highlights my bumpy bits. Um, the sleeves are all right. They're good length. Um, the bottom, again, is quite... That falls just at my knee. Um, it's a nice material, like it feels really nice. I'm just not a fan of the pattern. So I'm not going to keep this one either. I feel like all the dresses I got are following a very certain pattern. They're all flowery and I didn't realise this when I bought them. Or maybe they just looked better on the model than they do on me. But basically this is the next one which is a... It's kind of similar to this and the one before, it's, it's navy um, with pinks and greys um, but looking at it I don't think I'm a fan but as always I'm going to try it on just to be sure. So yeah just exactly the same, very straight up and down, um, not very nice, not very flattering. I'm not really a great fan of the pattern either. So, oh, it does have this little bit, which is different, like along the neckline, but other than that, not bad. So the next, and I think this is the last dress I got, is this um, orange, it kind of looks yellow in the camera, but I'd say it's more orange in real life. It's got the tie around the waist, and it's very floaty, it feels really soft. So I do like, oh and it's got a little like more frilly bit at the bottom. I do like this one more than any of the other ones I've tried on. 
So let's give this one a bash. Maybe this will be the winner. So this one, I do feel like it's a little better since it does kind of come in here. It gives you a little bit more shape. Obviously, I'm not the the best shape, but um, yeah, I like this one a little bit more. And you can't really see, but the bottom bit has got this nice round it as well, which I like. I like this. You can tie a little bow in it. Um, I think I might keep this dress. It doesn't... Yeah, I think I, I might keep this. Uh, I quite like the colour and I like the feeling of it. It's very, it's very soft. It is a little bit see-through. Um, don't know if you can see like the black. Yeah, so I think I might keep this one. So the next thing I've got is back to trusty black and I do kind of love this. Well, it's black with little pearls on the sleeves. Uh, one thing I have noticed about all the Shein stuff is that it creases very easily. Um, you can't really see it but it's, it creases very easily. Um, but yeah, I do like this and I like the little pearls. I'm not sure how I'd wash it, I feel like they'd fall off but I'll work it out if I like it and I keep it so yeah let's see what this is like so yeah I'm definitely more in my element with the black colours which typical always have been and I really like the sleeves and the pearls that you can see and yeah I just like this I like how it's black I like how it's got some white to make it kind of stand out a little bit more um, so definitely going to keep this one Next up we have more yellow, but it's a top this time. Um, it's kind of similar to the dress. No, it's not. It's not similar to the dress at all. Dress was circles. This is flowers. So I do like this and I think this is definitely going to be more of my style. So let's try it on. So this is kind of similar to the first one, like the pink polka dotty one. Uh, it's got the peplum style to it. And I really like this top actually. Didn't think I was going to be that fussy for it, but I do like it on. So another thumbs up. I think I'm definitely going to keep this one. I've not got too much left, but if you're sticking with me then thanks and let's see what the next thing is so next up is this which has like a crossover design you can't really see it on the camera but it like it's a crossover although one thing i didn't notice when i bought it is that it's longer on one side than the other side which i'm not sure i'm a fan of that it has long sleeves i like that um but yeah this long side thing not sure not sure how i feel about that but let's try it on um not a fan it's also a bit gapy here that you can see so that's not ideal to start with and I'm also not a fan of this side like see if this wasn't gapy if this was just closed and it had all been one set one length it had all been one length probably would have kept it but with this and this I'm not a fan this is a thumbs down and definitely going back Next up we have this top which is a little bit flowery but I'm not sure if I like it or not. Um, I do like the colour with the teal, I'm just not sure how I feel about this big massive flower on the front. Um, I guess we'll see when I try it on if I like it or not but I like the colour just not really the pattern as is typical with all the stuff I bought. So again this is something I would probably wear with jeans and I do like the colour but I'm not sure how I feel about this pattern. Um, I think it's just a little old but which is a shame because the top is nice but I don't think this is one for me so I think I might send this one back. Sorry I forgot to show you this without it being on but I'm not a fan. This is very tight. You can see my little chub rings there. The sleeves are quite nice and the top obviously I am wearing a black bra so I would be wearing white or strapless or something. Uh, I do like this bit but not a fan. Not a fan of the rest unfortunately. So this is going to go back as well. So next I have this other black top. A little bit see-through as you can see. Not really a fan on the back. 
it's meant to have this bit but it just doesn't seem to sit right and I'm not really sure what's going on. Don't plan to keep this one, just not, not a fan of this one. So next up I have uh, a skirt and it's just like animal print. Not in sure, not really sure how I feel about it, but let's try it on anyway. Okay, so 100% not a fan of this. You can already see where it doesn't fit great. And yeah, I'm not really a skirt fan to be fair. It is very short, I feel like my bum is hanging out. And definite no, this one's going back. So to be honest, I feel like I'm wearing jammies. Uh, I just feel like these kind of shorts don't fit me, like my shape as a person and yeah, even without the tie, with the tie still not a fan, so these ones are definitely going back as well so the next thing I have is this top which I liked on the website but now I see it I'm not really a fan. I mean the sleeves are pretty jazzy and cool. Uh, they're like mesh with like velvet which kind of freaks out my fingers a little bit. I don't like the feeling of it but it is also buttoned up the front which as we know is not the greatest when you've got quite big boobs. Uh, it does gape a little bit but let's try it on and see what it's like but how cool are these sleeves? <laughs> So yeah, as expected, gapey. I mean, the sleeves are pretty cool, but um, overall, not really a fan of the whole look. Um, maybe if it had just been like a normal top, it would have been better. But uh, yeah, it's a no with this bit. So we're on to the last thing, which is very similar and it's it's got the mesh sleeves with smaller dots um, and it's got this like plunge a bit with like a wire in it so interested to see what this is like on oh if i didn't already say that this is definitely going back um so let's try on this this is the last thing so let's see how this goes fingers crossed for a good one I really like this top excuse the boobs they're a little bit out. I mean it really pushes them up there. <laughs> it is very tight, it feels almost like a bodysuit but unlike the white one I feel like it isn't as bad um, and I really like this one so I'm gonna keep this. I feel like I could even wear jeans like over the top of this. Um, yeah I really like this one. I feel like this was a good one to finish the haul on so I'm keeping this, I'm keeping a couple of the tops, the dresses, um, oh I am keeping one dress, I'm keeping the yellow dress, the orange dress, whatever you want to call it, I'm keeping that, the skirt, I'm not, no, skirt and the shorts are going back, um, yeah, there's a lot going back so at least I'll get some money back which is good. Um, I've never done a returns on a Shein order so I'm not sure how easy it is, I think I go on like the app or log into the website and just select the stuff I want to send back and then send it back like a normal package. Hopefully it's pretty quick. It was pretty quick in coming. Uh, it was about less, it was about a weekish actually um, to get delivered. So hopefully not too long I'll have some money back because I am skint. And yeah, so pretty successful haul. I've got one, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I'm keeping about half, half of the stuff that I bought. So yeah, I'd say that's pretty successful. Let me know if you've ever shopped with Sheen, Shane, Sheen. Let me know what you call it as well, because I'm really interested. <laughs> and let me know if what you've bought there. Let me know what you think. And. Thank you so much for watching this video. I ha I might have another haul coming in a couple of weeks, uh, but for now, sorry if the camera's really shaking, but for now, that's all. So thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to like and comment and subscribe if you're not already. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.